Hi everyone, I'm back uh, with short stories uh, that I was reading, Diana, Princess of the Amazon. So this is a continuation, chapters three and four. So uh, let's get started. The chapter three is called Only an Amazon. And remember, we left off where uh, Diana thought she had to prove herself and uh, Mona was kind of egging her on. Um, so we'll see uh, how it goes. Glorious battle, glorious battle, glorious battle. Face your doom. Glorious battle with a bunny. There's got to be a worthy opponent somewhere. Your doom is here. Mm, nope. Cheetah doesn't look very, uh, very vicious there. So there are no horrible creatures in the deep, dark forest. Hmm, no, just adorable fluffy animals. I think I'd like people better if they all turned into adorable fluffy animals. So, they just fight each other? That's weird, right? They're practicing for future battles. Battles against whom? Evil monsters. Evil monsters. But unless the bunnies suddenly start eating people, well... They do have to stay prepared in case anything escapes through Doom's doorway. Doom's doorway! What? We are not opening Doom's doorway. Why not? Because it's a stupid idea. Sorry, I didn't mean that. But behind that door is a whole prison of monsters. Not just a single creature that is a girl could that a girl could challenge to glorious battle. Besides, a strong magic holds the door closed. Only an Amazon can turn the crossbar that unlocks it. And since I'm not even sure if I'm really an Amazon, only an Amazon. I know, I know, but, but this is perfect. You don't have to fight anything. Just see if you can open the door and poof, We'll, we'll know if you're a real Amazon. Once again, I'm not so sure about this, but everywhere I see Amazons doing Amazon amazing, amazing things, things my mother won't let me be part of because I'm too young or because she thinks I'm not a real Amazon. I'm almost relieved when we get to the docks and realize that actually getting to the island might not be possible. There's no way we can uh, take a boat without being seen. Yeah, and it's way too far to swim. Unless, <gasps> you have an idea, don't you? Maybe, remember the dolphins? Weirdest idea ever. Huh, the dolphins are the least weird part of this plan. Wow, you really are strong. They were able to get to the island and go up a mountain. This feels like just another game we're playing. Shh, a sneaking game, a hiding game, a hunting game. If you can turn that crossbar and unbolt the door, you'll know without a doubt that you are a true Amazon. Magic doesn't lie. But if the door opens, it won't. Just see if you can turn the bolt all the way. The latches will still hold the door closed. But we came all this way. Don't be a wimp. Aren't Amazon supposed to be brave? I'll go make some noise to lure the sentry away. Do it fast. Be an Amazon. Thump, thump, thump. This doesn't feel like a game anymore. This is actually the door to Tartarus. What if I can't turn it? But what if I can? Only an Amazon can. <gasps> Mona? She did it. She was able to open it. Mona, I did it. Mona, Mona, what are you doing? 
Come on, Diana, it'll be fun. No, stop, you don't know. Flick. Uh, no. <gasps> oh, come on, come on. She's trying to close the door back. Something big is coming. Boom. Do you like my boom? <laughs> I'm not good at making sound effects. <gasps> And all of the monsters came out of Doom's doorway. The doorway is open! The defeated monster is sucked back into Tartarus, but how long until it comes out again? The signal! The horde is too great! Someone must light the fire! Ugh, go away. Diana's trying to go up to light the fire. And there's Mona waiting for her. Please don't do this. They'll see you. They'll know you're responsible. Why did you unlatch it? The monsters could destroy everything. I'm sorry, Diana. Here, I should be the one to light it. You hurry back to Themyscira before anyone notices you're gone. If they realize you helped open the door, they might decide you don't belong with the Amazons at all. But I can't let you do it alone. We're friends, Diana, birds of a feather. We do anything for each other, right? If I hurry back home and just climb into my bed. S Mona? Mona, are you okay? Mona, did a monster get her? Mona, Mona, where are you, Mona? I never should have left her do it, do it alone. The signal fire, but who lit it? Look, it's the princess. The princess lit the signal. This is all my fault. Chapter four, the best of us. I can hear the alarm bells ringing on Themyscira. They've seen the signal fire. There's some sea monsters. They're trying to grab the boat. Mona, Mona! Uh, hey, look out! Uh, er, she's trying to grab the monster. One of the Amazons was able to get it with her bow. Are you okay? We have to close that door. I can't stand my leg. I saw ships leave the Muscaria. Help is coming. If Hippolyta among, the, is Hippolyta among them, she alone could be strong enough to close the door. Without her, it will take more warriors than we can spare. I'm sure my mother's trying to get here, but there are monsters attacking the ships then we can't risk the weight. You can't, uh, the monsters we slay return to their bodiless, uh, bodiless forms and are pulled back into Tateras. But if we don't act now, they will keep reforming and escaping again. Until the door is shut, the battle is endless. Help, come close the door, come close the door. They're trying, but they can't get past the creatures. Can you get the door closed, princess? Yes. For once, being the smallest is an advantage. Come on, slowly the door starts to move. But I'm not fast enough. I'm not strong enough. Mona, what are you doing? You'll st you're still here? We need to get you back before the Amazon army arrives. If anyone sees you, too late. Besides, I need to help them stop this. Help them? Diana, they don't care about you. That's not true. You don't have to stay with them, not anymore. No, I have to find someone to help me shut that door. <gasps> Who are you? What did you do with Mona? Diana, I am Mona. That's not true. You, you must have hidden her. I took the form of your sculpture in order to help you, Diana. 
Your mother pretends to be the benevolent queen, but she is ignoring you and your talents, really for your own good? Hippolyta is jealous of your power and potential. Believe me, I know. I once held vast powers. Beyond this simple transformation magic, she stole the ring that helped me focus my powers and threw it deep into Tartarus. She stops at nothing to weaken anyone more powerful than her. My mother? No. Yes. You... You're Circe, the sorceress. My mother told me about you. I'm not surprised. I was quite popular. Would you like to hear my side of the story? The door! It's too late, Diana. The Amazons weren't prepared. And when they find out that you're the one who opened the door, they'll banish you. Come with me. You're smart and strong and only getting stronger. Once we get my ring back, we'll fly out into the world and do anything we want. Anything. Ugh, who dares attack me? Oh, I don't think so. Stop it! Stop! You are a monster! Diana, please, it's still me, your friend. We both just want to be great, to prove that uh, to everyone that they underestimated us. I need to get back my ring. If you won't go with me, then I'll have to go in there alone. You're my friend, so I know you understand. No. No, Mona, I can't let you. Whatever power we have, we should use to protect people. Sorry to be blunt, but I don't have time for this. Whoop! <gasps> Let's try this again. What? How? I, I'm still me. Made from clay? There's, there's something else in you. What are you? I'm an Amazon. Touch me, little princess, and I swear I will destroy you. It's Circe. There, Circe and Diana, Hippolyta. Circe is more dangerous than all the monsters. Stop her first. Your turn, Hippolyta. She pretty much turned everyone into an animal. Ping! Hold still. No! Wow, go mom. Diana, shut the door. I can't. I tried. I'm not strong enough. You are strong enough, Diana. But you are. I can do this. I can. Ugh, I'm strong enough. I am. I am an Amazon. Grr. She was able to close it. She was right. Mom was right. You, you ruined everything. I don't deserve this. I was your friend. You were never my friend. Well, the closest you've ever had to one. We had a lot of fun, though, didn't we? You do not speak to my daughter. And why not, Queen Mother? Someone should talk to her. You certainly don't. She's a good kid. If I were her mother, we could have some real fun. With no new monsters emerging, the Amazons from Themyscira are able to defeat the rest. <laughs> Change them back. What? What? Whatever would I do that? Why ever would I do that? Return them to how they were, Circe, and I swear I will let you leave unscathed. You swear? Swear by what? By my undying love for my daughter Diana. Very well, but you know I can't use my magic while you have your horrible twine around me. No tricks, Circe. Never. Seuss forbid. You know, Diana, will always be leave now. Hmm. Birds of a feather. Mom, it's all my fault. I'm sorry. I'm so, so, oh, sweetheart. And so, Diana of Themyscira, you are hereby ordered to make reparations for the damage you have caused. It's fair. I'm really, really sorry. We know, Diana. In addition to your punishment, the council has chosen to entrust you with a new responsibility. You will be Themyscira's 
first wild life steward, cataloging and counting the animals of the island. Report back to us about their needs. I will, thank you. And with Lord Opal defeated, Gemerald prospered. And lift. One, two, one, two, three, pull. She was doing her work with the Amazons. You only took a few buns. That's okay. I'm happy to bake with you all day. I don't suppose you'd be up for a break. <gasps> Good shot. Do you mind if I step in? Not at all, my queen. Can I ask something? Did you really did you steal Cersei's ring from her? Yes, I did. Why? She had so much power and she used it to make her kind of fun, no matter whom she hurt. That's what I thought. She never could have tricked you like she did me. Oh, she's fooled me before. Over the years, she's fooled the best of us. Diana, you are the best of us. Maybe when I was little. No, now, right now. I, I don't feel like that, not anymore. Then that's my fault. I got busy and forgot to show you how precious you are to me every day. So come on, show me what you've got. Whoa, you're fast. Try to block this. Ha! I'm unstoppable. I know. The mascara, it's not too bad a home for a kid like me. The end. Well, that was the end of this short story. Um, comment and let me know uh, what you thought or if it was too long or um, just anything, any thoughts of, of uh, my reading and uh, reading a short story like this. So I can't wait to hear from you and uh, bye for now.